Welcome back, friends. The musical Rent opens tomorrow night at Civic Theater in Carmel, and the cast is here to give us a special preview. Here they are performing Seasons of Love. Guys, take it away. Amazing, fantastic. I, wow. I kept getting goosebumps the Great. whole time. That was awesome, you guys. Way to go. Oh my gosh. Yeah, fantastic. Welcome to Michael J. Lasley, the executive artistic director at Civic and the director of so Rent. Good. Yeah, it was They're awesome. pretty spectacular. This is only half of them. We are have, you okay? seven, we have ten more. Nice. You guys okay. sound amazing. That was awesome, you guys. I cannot get over that. Uh, well, if that's not a reason enough to see it, I don't it's know what it is. That's definitely all you need. Yeah, yeah right, right there. Yeah. <laughs> well done, Jonathan Larson. But, uh, yes, well, that was incredible. <laughs> Tell us why this show is so important to you. So, you know, there are a handful of shows in the Lexicon of Musical Theater that sort of changed the game, changed yeah. mm -hmm. how musical theater is approached, produced, and this is one of them. It's a it's 20, more than 25 years old, this yeah. show. Oh, I didn't uh, realize that. On Broadway yeah. for 13 years, been to, just had a, nas a national tour for its 25th anniversary that has been going out since COVID was, you know, sort of died down. Mm -hmm. So, uh, you know, it's just a really important message. Yeah. And the thing is, like I say about the show, it's a period piece, but it's not a museum piece because all mm. these issues that we deal yeah. with are yeah. still there. Mm -hmm. AIDS is still a crisis. Yep. Mm -hmm. Homelessness, still a crisis. Uh, you know, struggling artist still something that's very real in the world yeah. sure. finding their place so uh, it's a great it's a great story it's as it's great. timeless and it's the first time that it's appearing on the stage at Civic it is first full-blown production we did a okay. concert version 12 years ago nice. um, that for just one weekend so this is a fully produced you know it's the Broadway production what do you hope people experience when they're in the audience Mike? I think it's nostalgia for a lot of people yeah. certainly yeah. and that we've certainly gotten that message from people mm -hmm. you know, that you grew up with this sure you know you're in your from anywhere from your know, early 20s to your 50s and your early 60s and this is a show that's really real for you yeah so you know true. experience so and mostly it's that but also 
we're introducing to new audience as well. Yes. Young, young young people who have not seen this. We've learned with them. Mm -hmm. They don't know about the AIDS crisis. They yeah. don't know about a lot of these things. Yeah. This is before smartphones, not sure. before cell phones, before smart yeah. smartphones, yeah. before social media, before all those things. So, you know, it's a very interesting piece from that perspective. Yeah, it is. And ultimately, what do you hope that the audience is then going to take away after seeing yeah. this performance? You know, I mean, I think it's all said in this song uh, above all others. You know, you can measure life in so many ways, but don't measure it in money or yeah. possessions. Or measure it in the love. Mm. Measure it in that. And that's what we're telling. We're showing these beautiful, beautiful love stories. Some of them are struggles. Some of them yeah. are sweet. They're tragic. They're all of these things all wrapped into the show. It's an amazing show. It opens tomorrow night, and you can enter to win two tickets to rent at Civic Theater. Theater, you need to email the code word CANDLE to civic at civic theater, that's RE dot org, by 5 o'clock today to enter to win. That's right. Can we yeah. get one more shout out to to the performers oh over my here? Gosh. Outstanding, Thank guys. You. That was awesome. That was just amazing. Way to go. Yeah. So, so good. Thanks, Michael. Thank you so much. Hey,